people and uh, we perform contemporary indian music and uh, as the av said uh, we have been performing from probably 2007 and it's, it's been a brilliant 8 years of journey together and we are a band basically uh, based out of chennai and all of us grew up in chennai and so uh, the journey of music obviously began with our parents inculcating some music that we probably got trained under the music of uh, ms subalakshmi or balamurli krishna has been something that we all grew up listening to and all of us have had those roots in us and that's where we started when we were young and most of us come from that background so well we've been playing for about 8 years but then the joy that we have when we perform something that we learned from our gurus as kids and some good classical music that we try to create on stage in our own style is something beautiful and so that's going to be the first piece that we're going to be presenting today and as we perform I'll talk along the journey of the band and here goes something for you guys Thank you. 
So, so I started the way. So, what we perform, what we have been playing, the joy that you know gives us when we play something that we learned from childhood, is what we guys presented to you. So, as we, as we all like, it will grew up in Chennai and most of us have been trained in South Indian classical music, be it the violin or the vocals or the keyboard and stuff. The biggest platforms for us as we grew up was to perform in our school called Culturals, the annual day programs that used to happen in school. And as we grew up, of course, the intercollegiate events, be it the college Culturals or the various symposiums where people could perform. And just to mark account, four guys on the stage are engineers and so just one me is an exception who is not an engineer. So most of us actually used the platforms, you know, the, where we performed during our school and college days to come up together. And that's how this bo band was formed. And we found each other in various cultural events and then we kind of decided to put us together and see how we could, you know, perform when we come up together as a band. And that's how Staccato was formed in 2007. And so initially, like any other band, we guys started performing at various small gigs and what we used to perform was something that we grew up listening to, which probably had an influence in every kind of music that we kind of put up on stage, which is nothing but the film music that we all grew up listening to, be it an Ilai Raja or an Adi Burman or Mr. A. R. Rahman. And the influence of such legends is just, I mean, it's just very difficult to do something without the influence of the music that we kind of grew up because we were the 90s generation. And uh, so in, in such progress, the two biggest milestones that the band had is uh, one performing in the freestyle percussion festival that happened in Brazil, the Rio festival in 2011. And the year later in 2012, we were one of the two bands that represented Asia and performed at the London Olympics in July 2012. So the journey was really not easy because the platforms were big, the opportunities were big, but then we had to put us through a lot of struggle in terms of reaching out to the sponsors and putting the band together and what did we actually want to perform? We are representing the country or the continent and what is it that we wanted to give? So probably world music is what people would think, but where's world music? We thought we have world music and the influences in every music that we kind of, you know, listen to in today's generation and the film music had influences and the Carnatic music had influences or the jazz or our own compositions have influences across various genres. So that's what we put up there and from there it, it's been a brilliant journey that we guys have been putting up together. And just to add to one thing that though most of them are engineers and me personally I'm a chartered accountant but uh, we all decided that you know music is what something that gives us really a lot of happiness. It's not an easy decision. It's it's very difficult to convince your parents or your girlfriends. And when you're in 20s, it's all, you know, it's all gloomy and love and all that. But the real crisis begins at, you know, the quarter life crisis is what people call. And so each of us pursue music, but then we all have something individually and unique that we all pursue. And the joy is when we all perform together as Staccato. And there's one guy who's trying to get into movies and composing films and there is an, two session artists who are developing themselves, jamming with various musicians and I come up as an independent artist by myself and so we're just trying to do a lot of things standalone but then when we are together it's, it's more for the fun of you know performing something on stage and let me not talk more because the next thing that we're going to be doing is something that we grew up listening to and it's a small tribute to Ekunar Sigaram K. Balachandar so it's film music is something that we would really love to perform on stage but be it in our own style, it's going to be unique for you guys. And Sandamir could the covey they part of me. 
someone said there's no creativity right so there's creativity in every piece that we do on stage but then the joy you know we don't know whether we get it when we perform someone else's composition be it rahman or elai raja or something that we would want to create for ourselves as a band so in in in, in using all the influences that we probably you know uh, over the years we just come up with some small tunes that that we call them our own compositions and small piece for you guys the first time probably you guys will be listening to it but then i'm sure it it's as musical as any of the other tracks that we performed and Sila 
Chalu Varun on the bass guitar, Ila on the percussion, Manoj on the violin. I'd like to thank our sound producers Hafiz and our band manager Ashok and this is me Gautam on the vocals. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Have a great evening. <laughs>